hey everyone welcome back to my channel and today i'm going to be doing my hair and today i'm going to be putting some more passion twists in my hair um i have done i have done a video on passion twists but it was shorter passion twists so today i'm going to be doing long passion twists because i am going on vacation i wanted to do something long and cute so i'm going to be putting passion twists in my hair but i kind of want to do them a little bit like a little bit bigger parts so i'm going to be doing some bigger parts but I got this hair from, I ordered this hair on Amazon from the brand Syria and this it's called the Six Packs Crockett Passion Twist Hair um, and it says that this is 18 inches long. However, normally with my previous experience with Passion Twist hair, it pretty much stretches. Hopefully it stretches because 18 inches is pretty short to me. So I hope that it's longer because I don't really want to have short hair for my vacation so we'll see whenever i put it in but i'll leave the information to the hair below but i did get this in the color 1b so it's more of my natural hair color and yeah so i'm just gonna go ahead and get into this video start twisting my hair parting blah 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 i'm not gonna talk you guys to death so whenever i get to the front i'll probably show you guys or i'll probably slow it down for you guys so you guys can see how i actually put the passion twist in if you haven't seen one of my previous videos on pretty much a how to passion twist video but i also just want to do a really good review on seeing how this hair actually does compared to the other hair that i use and if it's a good brand to use so let's just get straight into this video this is the hair that the company sent me um it comes in this nice package and it has six packs and i know you might be thinking that six packs is not a lot but Last time I did my hair, I ended up with like an extra pack because there's like a lot of hair in these individual packs. So it does come with the little crochet thing, but I won't be using that because I start mine off with a little braid, which I think is a lot easier. Um, and I like how it looks. They also put like, what is this? They put a pin in here. <laughs> I don't even know what that says, but look at the pin y'all. I'm dead. <laughs> and they also have like some little clips. I guess you can paint your hair. That's pretty cute and probably will be helpful. I actually might use that to be honest. It, it comes with two, a pink and a red one. And then they also have some little hair clippy thingies that you can use. So yeah, that's all that pretty much came inside of the packaging, but I'm not gonna talk you guys heads off. Let's go ahead and get into the video and I'm gonna show you guys how you know how I do my thing to come show you guys what the hair looks like I forgot to do that so the hair looks like this and it's in a net so there we go I was looking for the net but here it goes this is the hair it has a pretty natural shine to it I guess you can say it's not too fake looking the hair looks like it's amazing I actually had um, I actually did a different company's hair and this hair looks a thousand times better in my opinion than the other hair that I reviewed so I'm really excited to try this out and it has let me see how many it has on here one two three four five six seven eight nine 10, 11, 12, 13, 15, I believe, um, on here, if I counted that right. So that's a good bit of hair on one ring. So I'm just gonna go through and twist my hair up in the back and then I'm gonna slow it down in the front so you guys can see. So I'm going to take a piece of hair and loop that around my natural hair. And that will be the third strand of the braid. And I'm just gonna take the three strands as if I'm doing a regular braid and just braid all the way down until I feel like I've braided enough so that the twist has a good strong hold from the base. So I don't do any counting of like how many times I braid. I just go until I feel like it's enough. And once I feel like I've braided enough, then that's when I will go and divide my natural hair into the two strand twist. 
So um, once you get to that point, just break it into two. And then you're also going to take a good amount of gel and coat your hair in that so that it easily blends in with the braiding hair or twisting hair. Now this is going to be where I extend the twists to make them longer. Um, I'm going to take another strand of passion twist hair and I'm going to just continue the twist but I'm going to just add it in. And to make it hold very strong you want to twist it around to be in sync with the other piece of hair. So by twisting it it will make sure that it won't unravel and that it's very very strong strongly connected to the other piece of hair and this is how I extended my twists and I really really love how they came out. If you need more details on how to do this I do have a very basic video on my channel on how I do passion twists so I won't go too much more into detail because this is just pretty much me reviewing this hair and also just showing you how I got the really long um, length of it. But yeah, go check that out if you still have more questions. Excel on the track. So guys, it is 3.53. It took me about... Let's see, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, pretty much seven hours to do this. Um, it really would have taken me that long if I didn't decide to extend them to be longer. Um, that definitely added a lot more time to it, but I really, really, really love this hair. Like compared to the last hair that I had, oh my gosh. Like I can definitely see the difference, definitely see the quality of this hair is better like the ends are perfect like do y'all see these ends like yes period like the ends are here i have to actually go back in the back of my head and extend those because i initially started doing my hair with just the regular length so i'm gonna go in and fix those but i'm gonna do that tomorrow because it's really late it's about 4 a.m and i have to wake up at 7 so i'm gonna get like three hours of sleep Anyways, <laughs> just like I really, but I just really wanted to touch on the fact that I really love this hair. I really love the the texture of it, the shine, just everything about it. Um, definitely would recommend getting this hair. It's definitely really good, really good quality. Um, it did come in 18 inch though, so that was very short. I'm not actually sure if they have longer inches I didn't even realize that I was getting 18 inch so that's why I ended up stretching it because 18 is just too midi length for me like I'm here for the 30 inch so I needed to you know stretch it but <laughs> if that's not your preference you can just go definitely go ahead with the 18 inch that would be perfect for you but yeah I'm definitely gonna wear this on vacation I'm here for this look here for the vibe why did I just do that? I'm here for the vibe that it's giving me. 
and I actually might have to go in and redo some of them because I definitely got lazy and tired on some of them but that would definitely happen a different day because baby it's time for me to sleep but I give this hair a thumbs up um, it's really good hair and I definitely recommend it I give this hair a 9.5 out of 10 because it's really good I just didn't really like the length so that's where the 0.5 comes off at but do y'all see this like let me just show y'all where it comes down on me like in the back and I'm not even done finishing the back but it comes down to about my butt um and like I said I'm not done but that's super cute to me and I really love it I really love it so go out get you some hair do your passion twist this let me know if you like this video I hope you like this video if you did give it a thumbs up for me also make sure you hit that subscribe button and don't forget to make sure you comment below um, tell me how much you love it tell me if you like it don't like it whatever <laughs> but thank you guys for tuning in and I'll see you guys next time bye